Have you ever wondered what will happen to your fussy hair after flat ironing it? Well, this is my story. Hey beauties, welcome back. So guys, in today's video, I'm about to show you guys what my hair looks like after three days or four days? Four days, yeah, four days after flat ironing my fussy hair. Of course, I know what it looks like, but I just want to show you guys and also do some DIY treatment on the hair and see what the result is going to be like from now to two weeks time. You get, if I'm going to get hair breakage, heat damage or whatever, which I do not wish for, but if it happens, it's okay. It's okay. <laughs> Today, I'm going to be trying the banana hair mask and I'm going to be adding some couple of things I have at home like the shea butter, Jamaican black castor oil and um, coconut oil. But before I do that, I'm going to add um, rice water to my hair, you know, just to the state it is now and leave it for like five to 10 minutes. Then I'll wash it. I'm just fast forwarding but guys you're going to see how this whole situation is going to go so if you're ready for this please do keep on watching oh wow oh wow this is what my hair looks like guys this is it let me take off this band oh wow oh wow <laughs> Oh, wow like wow <laughs> i don't even know what to say i'm just saying oh wow oh wow because i'm short of words but anyways so firstly i'm going to spray my hair like i'm really going to dump my hair with this rice water i just made just in case you don't know how to make rice water there are a lot of videos on youtube but i also have a video on it on delia's vlog if you don't mind you can go check it out because i don't know how i can link it here except i copied the link in the description bar but however guys if you do not see the link in the description bar you can just check on delia's vlog which is my vlog channel i have the is it recipe or tutorial i don't know i have the tutorial up on there so you can go check it out it's very easy to make so in here i have my rice water which will be enough for my hair and mind you i'm going to be doing this once a week like the use of rice water and whenever i'm doing it i'm going to be using a new one like a newly made one all right Woo, let's do this I don't know for some reasons a lot of people get scared if their hair will revert to the natural state after flat ironing i don't know why it's like that so like i earlier said i'm going to continue with this rice water treatment and i should be back in three months oh my god i should be back in three months to tell you guys my results or you know to give you guys an update on what's up with my hair hopefully i do not have any damage that will require me to cut my hair hopefully hopefully so i should be back in three months to you know update you guys on what's up with the rice water treatment so as you can see you just need a little bit see i still have this uh, much left on the on a uh, spray bottle which i'm going to throw away once i'm done so I have a generous amount like enough on my hair already at the moment i do not have a shower cap or plastic hair cap you guys know what i'm i'm talking about so i'm just going to wrap it up with a plastic bag you know like the waste plastic bag we have in the house and i'm going to leave this rice water to sit for um five to ten minutes and i will rinse it off and i'll be right back All right guys so i'm done washing the hair so i'm covering it with this cap just to uh keep the moisture within all right so for this cap i think you guys have seen it once or twice here but just in case yeah for those that are new so on the inside it has um towel 
all right and on the outside right here it has um plastic the tower is going to absorb the water then this plastic is just going to make the water stay within you know to keep the moist within the hair or rather the head so it doesn't go dry quickly yeah basically so i have my banana here and other ingredients that i've showed you guys before sorry guys if i'm sounding somehow my nose is it's closed literally so firstly i'm going to add a bit of shea butter into this plastic right here so more like um, a teaspoon of shea butter then i'm going to add a teaspoon of coconut this coconut is bio yeah it is by what I think any kind of coconut you have will do coconut oil <laughs> so something like this this is what I have in so far and then I'm going to add Jamaican black castor oil I'm running out of these already if not for the, I think I can find these online yes but I got this one from afro shop so I'm going to add a bit to it you know I still want to manage it <laughs> so I'm going to add like I think like so we'll do right so I'm going to melt it in hot water why I blend this banana and I'll be right back all right guys so I decided to continue this part of the video with a voiceover so as you can tell I already blended my banana and now I'm adding my melted shea butter coconut oil and Jamaican black castor the one I added in that bowl earlier so I melted it and I just added it into this bowl and I give it a good mix and this is what it looks like so now I'm just going to go ahead and apply it all over my hair like I literally applied everything and it was exactly enough if you just in case you do not know I blended just one banana all right so I added everything all over my hair like I applied everything all over my hair my hair and I gave my hair and my scalp a good massage all right and this is what it looks like at this point it was well well saturated so I decided to just pat it to show you guys and for you guys to see how shining and clean my scalp looks even though I haven't washed my hair yet okay <laughs> so this is basically it for now I think once I'm done with this section I'm going to get a thick comb and I'm going to comb through the hair so that is going to help detangle my hair just in case and as well you know if there is any strand that you know that the um this hair mask has not been applied to and it can make um go around I think that's what I'm about to say I don't know <laughs> but yeah basically guys this is all I'm I'm doing at this point so once I'm done with this I'm going to wrap it up once again with a plastic bag and I'm going to leave it for 15 minutes to sit and guys the result I got afterwards was amazing it was amazing and it's, that just makes me to you know want to try it again but but wait <laughs> I'm coming back to that so now i've gone ahead i'm sorry this is five minutes after um, 15 minutes after and you can see how warm my scalp is you can see the heat from the plastic so i'm going to remove it and just show you guys how it feels or rather how it looks guys my hair feels or rather it felt really really soft very soft than the way it usually feels I was like oh wow this is a good treatment but another thing is I don't know if it was because I thought I am my, my hair before now I don't know if that's the reason I got that soft texture you know of my hair but yeah so I'm going to wash this whole situation off and by the time I was done guys my fear came to life guys do you see this whole white residue all over my hair that's crazy and that is from the banana but the thing is, I there was literally no way for me to take this thing out. I tried to comb it. I could not take it out because it's all over the hair, like all over. So all I did was basically just leave it because at this point, like was I was done with this video, I was confused. I did um I did not know what to do with the hair. I just had to let the hair be. I left it exactly how you saw it in this video, and. Uh, 
and, and the hair dried up so once it dried up you don't really see like you're not going to see those white residue anymore you won't see it anymore but the only time i saw it again was when i washed the hair i think three days after so when i washed the hair three days after i saw a little bit just like tiny tiny bit here and there which was not giving me so much concern afterwards you know by then it wasn't giving me so much concern because you can't really see it so that was basically all i did with this hair and you can still tell that my hair wasn't fully fully like my hair did not fully revert you can see still see that straight like um like you can see that this hair was straight and you get so but yeah this was it guys and yeah i hope you guys enjoyed this video please if you like it do not forget to subscribe and yeah this will be it until next time stay beautiful and be blessed bye guys